YT42, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Um, as you might have noticed, I'm playing on cartridge, as you can see the red outlines with my room. And, because, um, on Visual Boy Advance, it just keeps crashing, and then I have to restart all over again, and I don't think I'm going to get through the game like that. So, for Christmas, I got Pokemon Ruby on cartridge, since I didn't have it. Um, but anyway, let's just continue on with the game. Uh, well, coughing. Coughing is a poison type with the ability to levitate. Um, as I said, I'm not really doing much work on reviewing Pokemon. Anyway, out here we get to Root... 112. And let's pick these berries. But sadly, since I'm playing on cartridge, I can't speed anything up and the quality is put. So, I guess you're just gonna have to live with it. I'm really sorry about that, guys. I think I should film at night or early in the morning. So, um, yeah, it won't get the camera will focus on this. Um, but hopefully, you guys can live with this. I'm really, really sorry for this. Um, yeah. Anyway. So, let's just continue on with the game. We've got a cool trainer here. New type of trainer. Show me how much you've t toughened your Pokemon. Oh, sure, I can show you that. So, I'll keep explaining the story. Um, yeah, so as I've told you, I've had to go through a lot to get this back, and so this shouldn't crash anymore. But damn, paralyzed zad 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 zad. Just saying that reminds me of the glitch in Pokemon Yellow. Zaz. Um. Anyway, I still have everyone here, as you can see. I got Rust, D64, Helper, Vault, Aqua Earth, Weeds, and The Voice. No difference from there. Um, don't howl up my face. You little A. Hey, hey, hey. Screw it. <laughs> what is with you? Don't howl at my face. Or in this case, you're howling at your face. You missed that? Sure. I'll, I'll, I'll take it. Uh... Wow! What is with me? The force is with me. No, no, no. Alright, so, Electric. Uh, ooh, CC will help her. Magnitude! Yes, yes, please. I would love to have Magnitude. Ooh, so let's get rid of Growl. Get Magnitude. Um, let's see. Whalemur. Switch to uh, weeds for that. And as you can see, weeds evolved. L unlike last time. Well, let's not make this complicated, but weeds evolved again! <laughs> Yay! Alright, so. I'm just gonna take down this Whalemur. If the bullet seed will do much and hit about four, five to Ah you, you you bad stinky thing that has honey coming out of its mouth and is watching a whalemer staring into its face and I'm going to stop now. So in the previous episodes, as you can see, I'm hyped up. In the old, in those other episodes, I was just tired and not feeling very good, so I don't, I don't know why I would film back then, but about a couple episodes later, I don't, I don't know how many. Uh, thanks for the paralysis, bro. Uh, oh yeah, luck's coming to my side again. Um, so yeah. I've 
Yeah, so that battle's done. I'm not... Alright, so there's something we want to do here. As you can see, this guy is in front of this really weird looking tree. What's that? What am I doing? I'm thinking about making my own, my own room here using a Pokemon move. I know, I'll give you this TM. Will you use it to make your own room? Yes. Obtains TM43. TM43 is secret power. Find a big tree that looks like it might drop some vines. Use secret power in front of the tree. Some vines should get free and drop down so you can climb the tree. You find a lot of space for putting your favorite things. It'll, also, it'll be your own secret room. A secret base! You should make one too. Another thing, you don't always have to make your secret base in a tree. Try using secret power on rock walls that have small indents in them. I'm going to look for other places too. Okay, bye! Yeah, my reading is the worst. But... Oh damn, I forgot, I don't have Slaver Baby anymore. Um, will you battle me? No. Okay, so she's gonna give you a raspberry. That has a spicy taste. I think? Or is that something else? No, it's a raspberry. It has a spicy taste, and I think it gives... Uh, never mind. Anyway, there's more raspberries over here. Um, something I didn't go over. You can actually plant berries to regrow them. Um, and you can water them with a whale mapail if you got that, which I don't think I mentioned in the episode. You should have got it in. Um, some orange berries over here. I'll pick these orange berries. Okay. So with this, let's continue on our way. Now, see how there's a big lump of sand here that we saw in Druford Cave? That granite cave, I always get that, I always get that wrong. Um, well, what we need to use is the Mark bike, which we don't have. We have the Acro bike, so we can stunt! But, the Acro bike, I just like the Acro bike because, um, of its, what you can do, and how you can retrace in a upcoming mountain called Mount Chimney, which is when we get the fourth, uh, gym badge. And you can talk to this old lady in this house here, and she'll get your Pokemon to full, he to full health. And she'll ask you again, but obviously if you just got healed, then no need. Um, so on our way, we're getting another Pokemon coming up soon. Swablu. Yeah, Swablu is... A flying type, and when it evolves, I, I think it's part normal. I, I, I'm not, I'm not sure. I don't, I don't remember. Um, but Swablu, hold on, that's gonna hurt. Um, Swablu is wow. Are you kidding me? Um, th thanks. I guess. Um. Dot 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 dot. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Uh, Swablu evolves into Altaria, which is what we're getting, which is what I'm getting for my team. Um, Altaria, it's a really good flying type, and I really love to use it. Um, so as we're fighting this trainer, I guess we'll go over some new Pokemon that are coming up. There's Skarmory, Steel Flying type. Uh, there's... What else is there? Damn, I don't know. Uh, there's Spinder. I think there's Spoink. I'm not too sure. Spoink is good if, you're, if you want a Grumpig. Um, but I don't like Grumpig myself, probably because, well, Richie Rich, when he plays Black 2, he likes to talk about Grumpig. I don't know, but that was that time, and didn't last very well, very long, and 
I never ever really liked Grumpy. Not because of its, well, not because of its looks, but because of the moves it learns. I might be wrong because in Generation 5 it might be better. Uh, but I, I just, I'm not a big fan of Grumpy. It's not the best psychic type out there. Done. what is with this girl just annihilating my team? Ah, uh, thank you, game. Kill that Rosalia and hopefully level. Ah, uh, yeah, thank you. All right. Um, I'm just gonna go heal up. So, yeah. Um, another thing is. Uh, what else is there that's on the next route? I'm not sure. Anyway guys, I think I'll just go to the next route. I'll see if it's still, if it's a fair bit away or if it's just like a meter away from that girl. Um, so no, I guess one route 113 is pretty close. And as you can see, this tall grass is covered in ash. And you find different types of Pokemon here, like Sandshrew, ground type. I think we've gone over that. Oh no, I might have not. I don't think I went over it. I don't think I typed in that saying that Sandshrew is a ground type. But let's get on with the next battle. Yes, yes I can. You're done. Now, oh, done. The Game Boy suddenly reacted to me pushing down. As you can see, there is a ninja boy. From out of the ashes, I leap. Hiya! I challenge thee. That was the worst fake voice I've ever made. Okay, so that battle's over and done with. God, their coughings are so annoying. Um. I don't really think you need this anymore. I think Rusty does. Rusty's... Rusty's the lowest level on my team, and yet it's pretty powerful. I don't get what's going on there. I'm also going to switch the voice to the front. I barely ever get to use the voice. Probably because I don't. Oops. Anyway... Here's a spinder. Pretty sure it's a psychic type or a normal type or just forget it. <laughs> I never, I never know a spinder. Um, I'll type it up on the screen. Anyway, we have another battle with a numble, numble, num num num. Anyway, I'll speed the rest of this up. Unnecessary to speed that up, but. Yeah. Um, let's see. Double battle. So, uh, I'll just put vaults in second. Why not? We battle Pokemon too! Th this is what I don't get. If, if you have to be 10 to get your first Pokemon, well, according to Professor Rules, then. Why? Why do these kids have Pokemon? It might be the mum and dad saying, oh, d "Why am I the most idiotic person in the world?" Um, they they what was I gonna say? Jeez. Um, it might be their mum and dad saying, hey, you can have a Pokemon, even though you're not 10, but, um, I think that still wouldn't be allowed. I think being 10 to have a first Pokemon is a law. Um, but still, these guys are like 5 or 7, and yet they're using Pokemon. 
But isn't that illegal in the world of Pokemon? I mean, jeez. And preschoolers, the type of trainers, those, they're even younger than these guys. So, I don't see why they would do that. Anyway, over here you can find a Max Ether. Um, pretty sure there's more on this route. Uh, let's just switch this around. No, the way so you can switch falls with wheat. Ah, sorry for the interruption there. Um, there's a ninja. There's a ninja kid here. Thanks for finding me. Thank, thank me for finding you. But you were the one who buried yourself in that disgusting soil. Wow. They were really mean to that kid. Look how many levels away. That that Nincata is one level away from evolving. Okay, so that means the next turn you're gonna hit me no matter what. Uh, let's go for an opera. Really? Use Mind Reader just for a Fury Swipes? Yeah, sure. Five times? Jeez! NPCs. Jeez, NPCs. Okay, so the voice has gained a level. Alright, Ninja Ask. This is more like it. Um, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna be stupid and use an item. Although, it probably has speed boost. Yeah, it has speed boost, I'm sure of it. Um, I'm just super potion. Why not? I'm not getting use of soda pops. Fury swipes. Jeez, man, what is with you and fury swipes? I feel sorry for that kid. He doesn't have a shed ninja. And shed ninja is like a beast. It's kind of cheap, actually. Yeah, speed boost, that's bad. Um, let's just annihilate with, uh... Are you serious? Wow, um, sorry, ninja boy. Singing my Boba that likes to hide in ash. That would probably cough him to death. Um, I don't get it. Why do you have leech life on a ninja -ask? ninja -ask and both ninja -ask and shed ninja are pretty powerful. Except I prefer if you if you want to be cheap then choose Shed Ninja. But if you just want to be like fair in that, um, and you just want to be fast then choose a Ninja. -ask. Anyway, in this house you talk to this guy. Um, I'm not even gonna try and talk about this, but this guy will give you the suit sack. You can walk around piles of ash. Which is that dark, that um, brown grass, and you will collect ash. If you come back to him, and you have like heaps of ash, it literally, it literally takes like forever. You should be able to. He'll get, he'll make a flute for you. I'm pretty sure that's what happens. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure it makes a. Anyway, this will be the last battle of the video. So, as I'm ending off the video, hey guys, this has been YT42, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.